Sponsored search marketing is an effective way to bring search engine traffic to your website. With sponsored search marketing, it's commonly known as CPC or PPC. These stand for cost per click and also pay per click. Now the networks to buy your sponsored search ads, there's three main networks. There's going to be Google AdWords, You're also going to have Yahoo Search Marketing and MSN Ad Center. With MSN having its brand identity crisis, who knows, in another year it could be the Bing Center. But for now, we're going to call it MSN Ad Center. These are the three main networks to buy sponsored search marketing on Google, Yahoo, and MSN. These are the platforms to visit to create a sponsored search marketing campaign. Just be careful when creating these accounts because if set up incorrectly, you could definitely misspend your budget and misallocate your money and it won't result in any returns. It's very, very critical that you focus on proper structure and creating campaigns in these three networks where you can actually track your return on investment, your ROI. Now, when setting up your accounts, there's going to be a few main areas to focus on. These areas are going to be your campaigns, your ad groups, and your keywords. Each of these sections of sponsored search marketing have different relevancy to how they're actually going to interact with the characteristics that your sponsored search marketing is displayed. At the campaign level, you'll be able to set time characteristics, geographic targeting, and also name the theme of what your actual campaign is about. Within your ad group level, you're going to be able to identify the structure of your campaign. If you're looking at it from an outline, it would go, you have your Roman numeral I, then you go into a capital A, which would be your ad groups. And then from your ad groups, these are going to house your keywords and also your ad copy. The ad copy is going to be how you entice the user into clicking your actual keywords. You want your ad copy to be relevant to the keywords because the search engines actually score how well your ads are performing to see if they should give you impressions. Impressions are the number of times your ad will actually display. The higher amount of clicks that you can draw into your ad copy, the more impressions the search engines will allow you for each specific keyword. The intricacies of sponsored search marketing go very deep. For example, in keywords, you have different match types, such as on Google, broad, phrase, and exact. And then on Yahoo, you'll have standard and advanced match, along with MSN Ad Center, you'll have broad match, phrase match, and exact match as well. You'll also want to know that you can program in what's called negative keywords. For example, if you're not doing free work, you'll want to put the negative keyword free because people actually search for free things on the search engines. So you'd actually program it as saying negative, exact match, free, you could also do negative, phrase match, free. As I said, the sponsored search marketing platform is very advanced. From these different areas to actually grade the performance of your keywords and your ad copy, you'll actually want to do something called installing conversion tracking. Each medium, Google, Yahoo, and MSN, has its own conversion tracking code. With conversion tracking, you'll be able to analyze 
cost per conversion, which would be your site actually hitting a specific goal. And you'll also be able to see your conversion rate which will be reflected in a percentage. These are two main ways to judge and grade how your